Hi everyone, um, this is Ajay again with uh, another video. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss um, um, MQTT, um, like how to test MQTT using uh, a Mosquito and uh, MQTT FX. And uh, Mosquito is going to be our broker and MQTT FX is going to be uh, the client and uh, it is a very useful tool to learn uh, um, MQTT, about MQTT and we are going to uh, see some of the features of um, the MQTT FX and M Mosquito uh, where we can just uh, before uh, getting into the actual MQTT uh, publish and subscribe we can test our codes uh, and we can test our messages by pub uh, publishing it and subscribing it and this is what we are going to see in this video. Uh, now, I've installed uh, Mosquito, so you can uh, get uh, the Mosquito uh, into your Windows uh, or uh, Linux platform. It's available. And now, um, I'm going to run Mosquito. It's in my uh, drive now uh, you can see i have my command prompt running with uh, mus uh, mus i am into the mosquito path and i am going to just try a simple uh, pu publish run subscribe so what i am going to do here is um, i am going to i have installed mqtt fx and mqtt fx is again available for uh, the linux platform and uh, even windows platform so this is very uh, a very uh, easy to use tool and you can write simple scripts and you can just use this offline uh, tool where uh, first i'll explain about uh, the tool here here you can uh, i'm doing it again you can click here on the gear which is the settings where you have a profile name which can be given and then the um, uh, pro profile type it's musket uh, mqtt broker and then the broker address is here it is going to be the local loopback address which is 127.0.0.1 uh, in case of any other specific ip uh, or domain name you can enter that here and then the broker port is mqtt broker port that which is going to be 1883 and then the client id if you have a specific client id for mqtt you can enter the client id here and uh, the you can see the other uh, the, uh, general settings like connection timeout keep alive timer all those things can be set here and uh, if you're going to use the username and password all uh, to connect uh, get it uh, get the mqtt uh, subscribed so you can use this user uh, user credentials we are not going to use this user credential for now so um, i'm going to keep it like this uh, the basic settings and then we can close this if you are making any changes you will have to uh, cl uh, click on apply and okay and then um, now you can see uh, mosquito i'm going to just click on connect you can see a red color uh, uh, a sim uh, symbol icon where it's like um, when i click on connect it gets connected and um, now simply uh, there is a, uh, by default there is a topic here which is home garden fountain which is a simple topic here and i have entered a simple key here that is test this is our key and zero is value again key and then key, uh, zero key value again a key value this is a simple json um, format um, where this is going to be our message which is to be published to the uh, uh, subscribe uh, which can be published or subscribe uh, this could be published and the same can be subscribed on the other end now if we are going to make this uh, client that is mqtt fx to publish something we can have the quality of services as qs0 1 and 2 and uh, by we will fix this as qs0 and you can actually see the logs here completely and uh, now what we are going to do is uh, here for mosquito i am going to subscribe to the particular topic here that is 
I'll keep both windows side by side so we can view it properly. Now the basic uh, mosquito uh, subscribe command which is this mosquito sub underscore sub and the host address and then our uh, topic here it is uh, home garden fountain topic hash it is going to subscribe to all here now what we are going to do is just click on enter and now you can see since it's already there we have communicated so it's going to publish again so let's uh, test it again and i'll change this value here to uh, two and then let's publish and you can see the changes uh, seen here it has uh, published the message i'm going to change it to three now now we can simply see the messages here uh, on the broker mosquito broker and then we have additional commands which can be used here so let me disconnect here so what i'm going to do is uh, we can have the debugging messages like uh, when we use the quality of services or the if you want to see the message uh, ids those can be observed here so simply we can have the debug messages you can see i just add my uh, hyphen d which says sending connect received connect acknowledge and sending subscribe and uh, subscribe back publish and this uh, can be seen these kind of messages are the basic mqtt acknowledge uh, messages uh, connection and acknowledge messages which can be seen in um, uh, you can uh, which can be uh, uh, found in the basic MQTT uh, any MQTT uh, uh, connect, uh, protocol and now what we are going to do is you can see the message also and uh, when we use a different quality of mess, uh, quality of services it's like uh, at most at least you can see all the messages here now uh, since it's called, uh, QS0 you can see it is QS0 QS1 and QS2 uh, and uh, again uh, here i'm uh, we have not mentioned any qr service and by default it goes to qr0 that you can see here uh, that is qr0 um, now you can see a ping request and ping response has come now it's like uh, we have kept the uh, keep alive timer which is to be uh, 60 seconds that is one minute uh, we, we can even change that let's see all those things now what we are going to do is uh, change the uh, Q QoS QoS is uh, hyphen Q now the quality of service is 1 now we can click on enter and also we will click on QoS, QoS 1 here in MQTT FX and now I am going to publish you can see a publish and the pop back uh, has come so there is an acknowledgement uh, so there is that uh, when the message is passed there should be an acknowledgement if you want to more read about qos 10 uh, you can uh, read about the mbase mqtt protocol and even hive mqtt has explained those things very well you can check on that um, now next we'll check on uh, qos uh, 2 i'll change this also to qos 2 and now let's enter and now i'm going to publish a message you can see here we have published pub r uh, pub break and pub break release and pub compare so this is qs3 quality of you can see the message will be sent again it will be rechecked um, and the sub, uh, the subscriber will again uh, send uh, the release all those things so these kind of messages can be seen in uh, the QoS2. It's like uh, the message is completely received on the other end. So uh, it's like it has been subscribed like that. Or uh, next is, uh, this is the subscribing part. And the subscribing part, you can wait for uh, the, uh, now on the same side, I'm going to ju just show you the keep alive time. So what we'll have to do here is uh, just again uh, add one more um, hyphen one more command that is hyphen k and then i will keep this uh, as five so it's going to be five seconds so let's see whether uh, it's trying to subscribe uh, i mean sorry the keep alive time that is there will be a ping request and response so you can see there is a ping request and response earlier it was 60 seconds 
and uh, now it's uh, five seconds so this can be changed by default it is like uh, uh, ping uh, one minute is enough so you can go first with 60 so i'm going i'm just trying to show you how it works so th that can be changed here now let's look into uh, publish so what we are going to do is now we'll keep this uh, mqtt fx which is decline and uh, we'll, this topic can be anything the same topic uh, the mosquito broker has to publish to the same uh, topic which the mqt effects has subscribed so what we are going to do is use the publish command here that is so i've kept it ready i'll have the debug messages also together now Um, what we are going to do is we are going to subscribe to the topic the connection is already established now we will uh, get our MQTT FX subscribed to the topic now to the same topic you can see v1 my topic test uh, this topic can be any topic which we are going to subscribe and now uh, what we are going to do is publish message to this the message can be seen here one minute I made a mistake here yeah now I click now you can see the message is here that is message id 1 and u is 0 and key, uh, key 1 key 2 uh, key 1 is 2 and uh, key, key n value that is key 1 that is key, uh, the key and uh, key 2 is another key so uh, the values are 2 and 100 here so uh, it, it says it's uh, it has disconnected now the same thing can we can do with uh, the different quality of services so what we will have to do is add um, uh, hyphen q and then add uh, we'll make it as one Q, Q as one you can see here it is Q as zero and uh, now what we will do is um, let's get it unsubscribe and then uh, select Q as one and then subscribe back back to the position and uh, now you can see it's like Q as one and message ID two for the same topic and here you can see the uh, debug messages now if i uh, this is like whenever we are going to uh, when i try when we are trying to publish uh, we are getting this uh, publish disconnected so if we have to uh, uh, continuously publish with an interval we have uh, this that is repeat uh, with uh, how many times that is five times and then hyphen repeat hyphen delay we'll have uh, five seconds now what we are going to do is enter we can see here after every five seconds you will be getting a message you can observe here that's getting obvious so we can publish to any um, uh, broker before that we can uh, just check whether our messages are proper and uh, whether the keys and values are proper and then we can just test publish subscribe with um, by the client and the broker uh, then uh, after the test we can uh, actually take it to the next level so this is what uh, i wanted to tell you in this video and uh, I, I will give you some um, uh, uh, links on the video description which you can try that is uh, about the high MQTT and mosquito broker which has been very well done this make MQTT FX all those things so those uh, links will be provided in the video description and then um, uh, the basic uh, things are available on the mosquito website itself uh, under the documentation where you can get these uh, commands which has been executed so this is what i wanted to tell you in this video so we'll meet in another video thank you thanks a lot